What's going on, guys? Uh, Chris, hand loose cards. Um, what's been going on with me? So I know all 31 of you guys, I checked, it's 31. Okay? Not bragging. But uh, I know all you guys care. So, had another kid. Um, been really, really busy. So, um, if you got kids, you know, you get it. If you don't, you know, enjoy your peace and quiet. Um, yeah, other than that, I mean, things have just been busy. Um, got promoted at work, doing, doing more things there at work. Um, but I did put on a show two months ago, a month ago. Put on my first show, like I, like I, um, me and another guy from work, we, we ran it. We ran the show, um, in Evansville, Indiana, um, had a, I think we had 108 tables booked, um, a hundred of them showed up, so success. I was pretty happy with it. Just a one day show, um, looking to do our next one here, hopefully December, but um, scheduling conflicts. He's a, my buddy that I'm doing it with. He's a shift worker, so kind of, kind of difficult to work around schedules and things like that. But we do have our schedule booked for April of next year. So, um, but I haven't stopped collecting. I have some slabs that I'm going to show you, and then uh, I have my first. Uh, my first redemption card. So we're gonna see. Uh, I'll show you. I'll show you. I'll show you my first redemption card. But I'm gonna flip the camera around. Let's uh, let's just go from there. Man, rusty. All right, let's flip around and see what see what All I got. Right, so I have uh, I have six cards. I'm gonna show you. Well, technically seven. If I whenever I show you the redemption. So I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. I'll show you the slabs first. Um, so some of these are from the 300 uh, greatest baseball cards by Mike Payne. Um, we'll start with that. So got a Kurt Schilling Met Nine, um, which is it's a good grade, right? I mean, there's no point if you're collecting it. Me personally, in my opinion, if you're collecting it. There's nothing wrong with a Met 9, right? Nothing wrong with it. I'm a big Schilling fan. He'll get in. He'll get in. I'm not worried about it. Next. The Clemens. Near Mint to Mint 8. Um, whenever the whole buzz about him potentially going into the... Going, getting into Cooperstown was going on, these cards didn't, started getting... Pretty hefty. So I grabbed this one for 20 bucks. I was like, well, that's all I need. It's a great card. That man, he was such a freak. Such such a dominant force on the mound back in the day. Sorry, Colton. Gotta back gotta cover you up here. Um another nice little cardinal PC for me. Paul DeYoung. Having a rough start to the year, but I'm really hoping he's gonna turn it around. Uh Sapphire. Out of 25. Just an awesome card. Awesome, awesome card. I got two two of those. Uh, I got that one and a blue one. Um, probably going to end up flipping the blue one. Then, all right, sorry about that. I had an alarm go off. Um, okay, next, 1954 Bowman. Old Robert Feller. Old Bob Feller. SG, SGC3. Nice card. Picked it up at a show. Um, really small show. So it's always nice to see. Um, it's always nice to see some, some vintage there. Um, all right. So we're going to go to the, we're going to go to Bean Town now. I'm going to go with, uh, I'm going to go with Age Before Beauty. So I picked this up. It's my first HGA card. I don't like how wide they are. They're just too wide. They won't fit in any kind of 
like team bag or sleeve or anything like that. So you have to get like a full page sleeve. But this is the image variation and it's a green to 99. Love this card. One at an auction. I feel like I got it really cheap. Um, I'm a huge believer in Devers. And I feel like he is incredibly undervalued in the hobby. And I don't know why. He's a great baseball player. And then we're going with Beauty, a 68 tops, Carl Yastrzemski. It's PSA four. It's a great card. I just I needed a uh, I needed a nice looking Yastrzemski in my collection, and I was like, man, I really like that one. So I picked her up. I was like, yep, you coming home with me? And then here is my first Panini uh, Redemption card. Um, I got back into collecting in 2017. In 2017, I opened a box of uh, Chronicles Baseball. Inside that box was a Redemption card. Five years later... I found it. it's not like a show stopping card or anything like that. It's Orlando Arcia. You know, he's a he's a decent ball player, right? It's a rookie auto. But here's what here's what's crazy to me. Okay. Oh. It took five years for it to get here. Okay. Sorry, the light. Look at that corner. All of them. Five years and this is what you're going to send me? Yikes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but that's all I got for you guys. Um, all right. All, uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to keep, keep going with this. I'm going to keep posting more videos. This is, uh, this is enjoyable for me. You guys have a nice day. A good weekend, all right? Go Cards.